Hey, Dr. Nussie here again, and today we are going to review AHA sparkling water and determine is it healthy for weight loss? That's up next. Okay, so getting right into it, we are looking at AHA. This is a sparkling water and we are going to determine if it's healthy for weight loss. Is this a product that is useful to use when trying to lose weight, when trying to lose body fat? Is this something that will hinder you or is this a product that is approved, that is all clear, that is compliant with keto and low cal and low carbohydrate diets? And also we need to answer the question, is it useful? Meaning, how does it taste? Does it taste very good? Again, we can get into all of these products that are very low calorie and low carbohydrate and yada, yada, yada. But at the end of the day, if they don't taste good, what is the point? We're not going to want to use them anyway. I believe that if somebody is dieting or trying to lose weight, we should make that as comfortable a process as possible so you can stick with it for as long as possible, hopefully forever. Okay, so to determine if this is a product we are going to want to use, the first thing we need to do is look at the nutrition label. So let's do that first. So if we look at the label, this one is fairly simple, fairly straightforward. This is what we call a triple zero product. The calories are listed as zero. And then if we go down and look at the total fat content, it's also listed at zero. And then most importantly, in all of these cases, when trying to do these low carb keto type of diets are going to be the carbohydrates. And they are also listed as zero, including the total sugars being zero and no added sugars. Okay, so a triple zero product is usually a pretty good idea as far as a product that we can use when doing these types of weight loss programs. But we also need to look at the ingredients because there is a trick here. When using drink products, especially um, products that have zero calories and are drinks, we need to make sure they don't have artificial flavor sweeteners, artificial sweeteners such as sucralose or aspartame. Those products, those sweeteners, those artificial sweeteners have been linked to certain health conditions and also to weight gain. So we've got to make sure this does not contain artificial sweeteners. Let's look at the ingredients. Again, this one is very simple, very straightforward. It's a little difficult to see because they <laughs> listed them vertically, listed the ingredients vertically for some reason, but there's only two, carbonated water and natural flavors. So there's only two ingredients, nothing unnatural about it whatsoever. Somehow, AHA has figured out a way to make a product uh, that is flavored and, does, and contains no calories and is not sweetened with anything artificial, namely sucralose and or aspartame. All right, so it gets the thumbs up, the seal of approval as far as yes, it will be compliant with these types of weight loss programs. But the next question is, how does it taste? Now, what I have here is the lime watermelon uh, version. There's a bunch of different flavors. I've had a few of them. They're good. They taste like flavored sparkling water. So if you're into flavored sparkling water, um, right now it's about 95 degrees out and has been for what seems like weeks now. It's dead in the middle of summer. This is a nice refreshing drink uh, on a, in a glass of ice. Uh, so I think it's a very useful product as well. All right. So I hope you enjoyed that review on AHA Sparkling Water. If you did, hit that thumbs up button and make sure you leave me a comment to let me know what you want to see me review next. All right. Until next time, stay happy, stay healthy. I'll catch everyone in the next video.